Hello and welcome to the channel. I'm your host D-Day bringing you Let's Play Brass 1.16. This series will have two playlists, one edited and one unedited. So make sure you're in the right one before you thumbs up. Also be sure to subscribe for more modded Minecraft and if you're ready, then let's play with D-Day. Uh, now, yeah, we since we found uh, diamonds, we can start working on uh, smelting iron. So we just have to make our way back up to uh, our base and grab this gold while we're here. We're starting off with 16. 16 ish. This is nuts. I think we're gonna be good on zinc for a while. Now that uh, we have some more uh, stuff to work with, mainly the diamonds, we can get started on, uh, let's ditch a lot of this stuff. Let's go. Like that and sort, and I need three of these dudes. We can make a pick. There we go, our first diamond pick. And I'll be able to add this, there we go. Blast Furnace is gonna require sturdy stone, which requires four pieces of stone and four pieces of cobble. Let's grab some cobble. Eight. There's four. And let's go ahead and make the sturdy stone. There we go. We need to make andesite alloy, which we're going to make out of zinc nuggets and andesite. So we need to smelt up some zinc now. Eight. We'll wait for this guy to finish its piece of coal. We also need another furnace. So let's go ahead and make that. Do we have any more bronze? We do. And then we have eight. There we go. And furnace. Awesome. Let's smelt these guys up. And I do remember uh, that we have obsidian really close uh, over here by the nether portal. Let's go ahead and also, while we're here, ah, uh, we have an iron bee. I want that bee. Okay. Let's grab some of these magma blocks as well. Okay, and this. We can use our diamond pick and it has to be a piece of obsidian it can't be this crying obsidian thing got him and let's see yep we got zinc so let's go ahead and change this out for nuggets and then we can take our andesite like this like that we have andesite that oh, boy nice all right, can I sleep now? Cool. All right, and now we should have everything we need for the blast furnace. Obsidian, andesite alloy, furnace, and sturdy stone. Here we go. Blast furnace, all right. And we now have a good supply of coal. Let's go ahead and drop this off here. And now inside of the blast furnace, we can process all of our iron. Hey, there we go. We can also do some clay. Let's turn them into terracotta. There we go. And let's see, I should make another, uh, another furnace. There we go. All right. Split this up. Get some uh, bricks going. We need some bricks. All right, there we go. And we did three by, what is that? One, two, something, something. Let's just go. Three by, here we go. Yeah, we can do one torch on this side and on this side. There we go. Now it won't grow into those obscene trees. We got iron. 
And now we won't get that really awesome achievement since I accidentally made an iron nugget from those, or an iron ingot from those nuggets last time. Oh, my salmon has to go in my offhand. There we go. There we go. Awesome. Raw salmon slice. Love it. And we got bone meal out of that. So now what we can do is we have our blast furnace. And we can catch this cow. So now we can make the hopper botany pots. These are going to be awesome terracotta and flower pots. So let's put the flower pots we already have. Oh, I left them at the base, didn't I? Okay. So let's see, we can make three. Okay, so hopper, three hoppers, and then we need three flower pots. And the terracotta. Okay, so we got a brick here. We're, oh, I dumped them. Yes. There we go. Now we can make these dudes. Nice. So we have three uh, hopper botany pots. I love it. Let's go. Okay, so the next thing that I wanted to work on now that we have the hoppers, I'm going to keep the tab there. Organic compost. So now we have bone meal. We need tree bark, which comes from chopping those, okay, or we can use more bone meal. I think I'd rather use the chopping block. Okay, so let's go ahead and... Alright, eight. And then the stripped oak, I think we can process... Oh, cool, we can use stripped oak to go straight into chests. That's a nice recipe to, to, to use. Yeah, I like that. So let's go ahead and do that since we have these eight. Make four chests. That works. Cool. I wanted this tree bark. I wanted the zombie flesh, right? We got some zombie flesh. Oh, not eaten yet. Um, the bone meal and the dirt. There we go. And let's make some of this organic compost. Okay, we need the straw. Uh, one piece of straw. So let's gather some straw. Let's see. Organic compost. Okay, we can make two. I wanted three. And let's put this into the ground over here inside the water. So let's see, what are we missing for the third one? Bark or the zombie flesh. So let's use the zombie flesh and put this in the water as well. That organic compost is going to be fine. Let's go ahead and make one here, one here. So let's grab the one piece of sand and the sugar cane. Let's do that one first go. There we go. So we're growing sugarcane now. That's important. Okay, so definitely what I want to work on now. Let's see. Okay, cool. So this stuff has turned into rich soil. Awesome. That's what I was hoping for. It just takes a little bit of time. So now we can set this guy here. Rich soil, rich soil in those two. And then which ones did we decide on doing? We were going to do, oh yeah, tomatoes. Uh, I do want beets. And what was the other one for vegetable soup? Beets, carrots, potatoes. We have carrots. All right, we did wheat over here. We did cabbage. So we need carrots and beets. We have sugar cane. And we need potatoes. That's what it was. Okay. Get rid of the tomato for right now. We can do that later. Okay. So now we have the, uh, the potatoes growing. We have the beets and the carrots and the cabbage. And that is what's required for the vegetable soup. The vegetable soup does have, what is that, five haunches? 
and a lot of saturation. I love this. So let's go ahead and make this cooking pot while we're here. The cooking pot I did put here, we need one, two, three, four, five pieces of bronze. Do I have that much or do we need to make some more bronze? Four pieces, okay. Weird, okay. Cooking pot, there we go. We have our cooking pot. And let's put it right here for right now. <laughs> Neat, that's cool. That's cool, I like that. Okay, and what we need are bowls, right? Whoa, whoa, threw it, got it. All right, let me try to do this slower. There we go. We need some bowls, let's go with a stack of bowls. All right, we don't need to go more than a stack. All right, we have bowls, we can drop off the bronze. Oh, the salmon. I ate some of the raw salmon, so now it's eaten. And now we should be able to let me swap a Rooney. This guy. Oh, actually, I need to pull that and put it in here. There we go. We can cook some of our uh, our, our salmon this this way. Raw salmon, cooked salmon, delicious. Okay, but what we're working on is we need cabbage which I cut up into cabbage leaf. Uh, we need beets and carrots, and we need some potatoes. There we go. So, this should, oh, and then we need to give it heat. Does it need to be sitting like that? Looks like it needs to be sitting over a campfire which would be pretty cool because then it doesn't need a fuel, a fuel source. Okay, so let's see, can I do this? Oh, that is so cool! <laughs> oh, that is so cool. I wasn't expecting it to, uh, to have this grate. Oh, that is so cool. Oh, now we have heat. And yeah, this guy's not gonna burn out, so we don't need, uh, a heat source we don't need to burn coal or anything dude I am so entertained by this yeah it's available so yeah we put yeah <laughs> vegetable soup oh yeah there we go all right okay this does make two Ooh, I'm pretty sure we have another one what what is it tomato pumpkins we can do those all right and then we need two of these guys all right that was easy easy enough okay so cabbage will fill up what we need for vegetable soup there we go and then we'll put the cabbage how do i have it i have seeds on the bottom okay cabbage seeds and cabbage and then the cabbage leaf we'll just put it up for right now I don't think we really have to cut it up into cabbage leaf uh, it's not really that that crazy important okay so we need one for sugar and one for kelp and then I'll have to move this guy we'll go up right three and three I think that's good all right so let's go to three. We'll do kelp at the end. This will be for uh, create. So let's see, water and, oh yeah, let's grab the keys. Okay, so lock, lock, quantity, quantity. There we go. And one and, will it grow like that? That looks cool. Just water. Yeah, it's growing. It's growing kelp. <laughs> That's cool. Okay, we need uh, sand for the sugar cane. And I checked, there's no snad, unfortunately. And we can put you in here. And sugar cane. Nice. Quantity and lock. Okay, now we don't need the keys. Alright, and let's brave the unknown. Oh, are you serious? Uh, okay, so osmium, we found it. <laughs> Hi. Oh, there's a spawner right here. 
Dude. Rude. Rude boy. Dude. Wow. Reinforced ironclad bronze helmet of tenacity. Dude. The, <laughs> the decimals. All right. We have a really sweet helmet. We got osmium coming in. Six. Six. Let's finally make a pair of pants. There we go. This is embarrassing, not wearing pants. The helmet is pretty awesome. Boots, now we need to replace the chest piece. And for that, we need three more pieces. Two, two. Here we go. Chest piece, awesome. Oh, I guess it's not that big of a difference, but it is one extra toughness. Oh, but it has projectile protection. So it's kind of my choice. Projectile protection four or one extra toughness. I'll go with the toughness for right now. And then uh, later when we get an enchantment table, we can, we can deal with it then. Thank you so much for joining me today. Smash like if you feel like I earned it and click on my dude here to subscribe for more modded Minecraft every Sunday at 11 a.m. But be sure to yell boom really loud when you do. Loud enough to scare me in Texas. <laughs>